Welcome to my channel, The Free Mountains. Um, this video is the continuation of um, the previous one about the devil. This is part two. In this video, I'm going to make the differentiation between the devil and Lucifer, the archangel. The devil is not Lucifer and Lucifer is not the devil. As I said, we talk about two different things. Um, let's take a look, just a moment. First of all, I have to say that uh, Master Samael sent his own uh, message in the astral. He said, uh, tell them to whitewash the devil. This is Master Samael here giving me instructions last night. And I woke up this morning with his words uh, resounding in my head. Now, let's take a look about what does this mean. Yes? The devil is the result of perverted fire. We spoke about um, Black Tantra in my previous video. So, that produces uh, the perverted fire. The devil is also the shadow of the Logos in us. So, let's take a look at the transformation. We go from here to this side. The devil is the philosophical stone, which is dark as charcoal, the unworked stone. So it needs to be worked and be transformed into the perfect cubic stone. It needs to be chiseled. And uh, there we have the white altar in a church where the priest officiates. And uh, later on, it also becomes a crystal soul. Let's take a look again here. Um, you can also take a look at uh, my video number 34 where I mention my astral experience uh, of seeing my own philosophical stone. Now, um, the devil in us is also the I in us, the goat of Mendes, temptation, the sexual impulse. But once it has been worked, then it becomes Lucifer, the whitewashed devil, the carrier of light, the archangel Lucifer. And once it is fully transformed, then we incarnate the star of David. Yes, Lucifer, the archangel, is also known as the morning star, the divine being. Now, let's take a look. My next page. The devil is not Lucifer, the archangel. The negative is only the unfolding of the positive. The devil is the philosophical stone. Each one of us has his or her own devil. The devil is the shadow or the reflection of the being in each one of us. And it has power over the earth, over the heavens and over the hells. The devil is coarse black stone, not worked properly yet, that must be chiseled until it becomes the perfect cubic stone. Then the devil is no longer the devil, but Lucifer, the archangel, the maker of light, and Venus, the morning star. The devil, transformed in Lucifer, becomes all-powerful over the heavens, the earth, and the hells. That's why Master Samael says that we have to whitewash the devil with alchemy. The devil collaborates with giving temptations. Temptation is fire, but triumph over temptations is light. Yes, remember that if we do alchemy, we produce light. Yes, the transmutation of light eh, with alchemy, that's the energy that we raise along the spinal column. Mm, and that awakes, awakens the consciousness. Lucifer is the ladder to descend. When it refers to descend, we descend to the hells to work with the egos. And the ladder to ascend. To ascend where? To the heavens. Because once we have worked with the egos and whitewashed the devil, then we uh, are rewarded by ascending um, heaven by heaven. As you defeat Lucifer on top of his own body, one is triumphant over temptation and goes ascending degree by degree. But to do this, we must dominate the sexual impulse. As I said in my previous uh, video, what you do with sex gives the result. 
yes, in the astral, either white tantra or black tantra, and then you have the consequences. Let's take a look at my next page. <clears throat> we speak about the sacrament of Roma. Roma is Rome in Italy. You must we wash the devil, says Master Samael. Roma, read from right to left, is amor in Spanish. That means love in English. In this, if this sacrament of Roma, of love, is refined, refined means you practice it and practice it again and again continuously like a prayer, then you, be, you will be whitewashing the devil and destroying the psychic elements, the egos. Remember, Master Samael says that the devil is the I in us. Now, what about the Baphomet? This word, Baphomet, is made up of two Greek words, bath and metis, meaning baptism of light. Yes, the baptism of light means alchemy. When Moses descended from Mount Sinai, with the Ten Commandments, the Israelites saw two rays of light in his head, similar to the goat of Mendes. This is the reason why Miguel Angel, or Michelangelo, painted Moses with those two horns of light. Yes. Now, the goat is the symbol for the sexual force in man or woman. Yeah. Now you are realizing uh, the meaning or the message of the devil, yes, little by little. I'm hoping that now you can see by yourselves the esoteric meaning. Now, the mystery of the Baphomet is the mystery of sex. The pentagram, yes, that is in the head of the goat, of the devil, is the symbol of the verb made flesh, white magic, God, the Christ, the master of the White Lodge. And here we have a painting, a famous painting by Leonardo da Vinci called El Hombre Vitruvio, that I would like you to uh, Google it and uh, take a look at it. That's the perfect man, the symbol for the perfect man. And the pentagram upside down means black magic, the devil, evil, a fallen angel, or also the Black Lodge. So be careful where you go. Uh, you can find the inverted pentagram in many places. So it means this is, um, this is a place where the Black Lodge uh, meets. So be careful. Yes. Now, we go now to my last page. In the Apocalypse of St. John, we have this phrase. And he that overcometh and keeps my works up to the end, to him or her... I will give power over the nations, and he or she shall rule them with a rod of iron, and I will give him the morning star. The morning star is the archangel, the all-powerful archangel Lucifer. He that has an ear, let him hear what the Spirit said unto the churches. That's revelations. Remember, temptation is fire, but triumph over temptation is light, yes? And here we speak about what you do in sex. Hmm? Now, in the last uh, words, remember if you are to grow spiritually, education is not to fill a bucket. Education is lighting a fire. And this was said by the Greek Herodotus. I leave you now with a movie. Um, it's called Legend, 1985. And yes, I like this movie because uh, I, you can see here the transformation of a girl uh, who was living in heaven, but then she fell into the hells and she was trapped in the hells uh, by her own devil, her own creation. Uh, please uh, watch this movie. Uh, is really um, It reflects what we have been speaking about in this video. And in my next video, we will continue with a topic, with the same topic, the devil. See you in my next video.